Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. I hope you'll do really well. So today's video is one that I have not done in a very long time and I thought it was about time that I did an updated version and that is a what is in my bag video. That's right, I love these videos because I am a very nosy person. Now, a quick disclaimer, I have not tampered with my bag, which means I have not put anything in there and I have not taken anything out for the purpose of this video. So it's a very honest what is in my bag video. And now, before we get started, if you're brand new to my channel, don't forget you can click the subscribe button to become part of our Weird Magical Online family. But without further ado, let's just dive straight on in there and have a look what I keep in here. Okay, now before I get started, I know a lot of you guys are going to ask where this bag is from. So it's from Forever 21, it costs £25, and you know what? It's quite spacious, look at all of that junk. So I've never been one of these girls that want to spend hundreds or thousands on a handbag. I am just not that kind of gal. I'm happy with a £25 bag that holds all of my stuff, as long as it does the job of being a bag. Everything is grand, but each to their own. So without further ado, I guess I should probably dive in um, to the bag and oh my, there is a lot of junk that has accumulated over the last week or so. Okay, so the first thing in my bag is my mobile phone because I got back this morning from my boyfriend's house. So it is in my bag. I haven't taken it out today. I've been very well behaved. So this is my iPhone 7 Plus and it's got an Apple phone case in dusty pink colour and it has a pop socket. A lot of you guys ask what these are for. It's just to help you hold your phone better and to take better selfies without dropping your phone on your face, which is always a bonus. So yes, I have got my phone. Next in my bag, I have got a Ted Baker body spray and this is the pink one, this is very new. The lid is missing, so I'm assuming that it's in there somewhere. So yes, it's a very nice body spray and it smells so good. I always have to carry body sprays with me because I just like to smell nice all of the time. Next up, in no particular order, is a lip balm. This is by Urban Decay. It's their Lip Love. It's from their new skincare range, their Rehab skincare range, which is so good. But this I have been loving for the past two weeks. Uh, it just makes my lips very soft and I don't like going anywhere without some sort of lip balm because I get very dry lips, so I like to look after them. And this is my go-to lip product at the moment. So yes, love, love, love Urban Decay. Next are are my very <laughs> tangled house keys. So I have a purple pygmy puff, I have a time turner on there in case I want to do multiple things at once. I have a little plastic diamond, which I believe came from a Christmas cracker actually. Uh, my house key, and then I have a little Mickey Mouse and a letter C, which I got from Disney World. So yes, those are my house keys. Next up in here are my prescription glasses, which are absolutely disgustingly dirty. They need to clean. So yes, these are my glasses that I should use when I'm watching TV, using computers and driving, I believe. I am long, short-sighted, I think. I can see stuff close up, but anything further away, it gets very blurry. So yes, I always have to have my glasses on hand. Next up in here is another pair of glasses. These are my Valentino sunglasses, which again, are very dirty. Um, these are always in my bag for when I'm driving because I, you, ugh, it's horrible when you're driving and the sun's out and you don't have your sunglasses. So I always, without fail, have a pair of sunglasses in here. And these are my all time favorites. Um, they're getting a little bit battered, to be honest. I should probably replace them, but they're good. Next up in here is, I want to say my purse, I know that it's not a purse, it's a card holder. I don't use purses anymore, which past Cherry would have been like, oh, blasphemy. But um, yes, I just use card holders now. So this has my driving license in there. Look at that beautiful photograph. I have train tickets, an Oyster card, and my bank card. So basically my important cards live in my Quibbler wallet. Okay, let's have a look what's next. Okay, these are my wireless headphones. These are Plantronics. They're Bluetooth wireless headphones, which are fantastic. Their battery life's amazing. I bought these when I started running and they're just great. And you know what's great? When you have an iPhone 7, you can charge it at the same time as well as listening to music with these. So I don't need that silly dongle anymore. Life changed when I got some Bluetooth wireless headphones. So yes, these are 
blooming wonderful. I love these very much. So yes, that's what I use for running and listening to music and that kind of thing. Next in here is, um, <laughs> okay, I went to the doctors yesterday because I got um, a lot of asthmatic symptoms earlier this week after doing some exercise. Makes it sound like that's the only exercise I've done for months. It's not, I just pushed myself way too hard and I got a wheeze and a really bad cough for about three days. So I went to the doctors and told him and he gave me an inhaler because uh, I have exercise induced asthma. There's something really cool that I've always wanted. No, I didn't. But yes, I have an inhaler for if anytime it happens again because it's really scary when you can't breathe but yes got a little inhaler because i'm i'm really cool next in here um i have an empty alpen light summer fruits bar only 70 calories i ate this in the car this morning before i left my boyfriend's house because i fancied a snack and it was just in my bag so yes an alpen bar these are very very nice by the way i then have a receipt which is from Sainsbury's and I bought petrol for £22.29. Yes, I filled my little car up this morning and that's why I've got a petrol receipt. Let's see what's next. I have a lot of drugs in my bag, inhalers, vitamin D. Again, I got prescribed some vitamin D because my vitamin D was really low um, and I have to take four of these a day at the moment. So that's fun. My body, is just really shit. <laughs> um, so I have to carry things like this around with me, it's ridiculous. Next, I have got my car keys. So you've probably seen these before. I have a little yellow Fiat 500 fob and the key pops up, which is very satisfying. I have a Waitrose points card. Waitrose is like my favorite supermarket. I have a little Dory, some Baymaxes, a cherry and a little fob thing. Okay, what have we got next? Uh, this is my iPhone cable. Yes, I have got a little duck egg slash turquoise, it matches my top. Um, a turquoise iPhone charger. Um, I have one at home that I use here all of the time, but I use this one in my car or at my boyfriend's house so that I can charge my phone and I don't have to keep carting the one that I use at home around with me all the time. So this is my spare one for emergencies and such. Yes, it does me good. It's a very good charger. Next up, um, probably shouldn't be in my bag because I'm healthy eating at the moment. I have a small bag. It's not actually that small, is it? It's a share bag of peanut M&Ms. Um, I haven't eaten them all though, so I get points for that. Those were just in my bag from last week and they've just been in there and I haven't finished them, but I probably will finish them just to get rid of them because that's really logical. And then I have got in here a glasses case. This is what my glasses should be in. This case is absolutely stunning. It's like a mermaid. It's um. I don't know if it's as pretty on camera, but it's stunning in real life. This glasses case is from a company called Holes, which had some beautiful sort of, I can't explain the glasses, but they were stunning. So yes, this is my favorite glasses case of all time. Then I have got a few loose rings in the bottom of my bag. They're just black rings. I don't know where my other one is. I think, uh, the boy may have stolen it or I've left it at his house or something. But yes, I have got two spare rings which just float around. I've just dropped it on the floor so won't be seeing that for a while. I also have a lone penny. Um, I hate pennies. I think they're absolutely pointless to have. Um, oh, I'm rich. I found a 20p. We are finding lots of coins today. Oh, hang on. We found another 20p. I am like 41p richer since looking through my bag. I've then got some Trebor Extra Strong Mints, which had some fluff on, just threw it on the floor. These are my favorite mints. They're really strong, but they're so yummy. I live off these. They're absolutely delicious. I actually have some lone ones, which have fallen out, just chilling in, in the bag, but it's a clean bag, so it's okay. They're, they're okay. Waste not, whatnot. And then I think, is that it? I have a corner from a wrapper. I think that we've got to the end of my bag, which is pretty impressive that I carry that much stuff around with me all the time. Like, I'm not sure I need all of it, but it's satisfying to know that um, also there is nothing in the front pocket. So in case you're wondering. 
So yes, that is what's in my bag. Be sure to leave a comment down below letting me know some of the things that you have to have in your bag at all time without fail because I would love to know. You know what, something that wasn't in my bag, which is really unusual, hand sanitizer. That stuff normally is in my bag, so I'm gonna fix that. But other than that, I'm gonna go. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I guess I will see you in my next video. I'm very much looking forward to my next Wizarding World Loot Crate, which is going to be up at the end of the month. So yes, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys soon. Bye.